because men are not allowed to, our, our feelings aren't allowed to be valid, you know. And you hear a woman say that I apologize after, tw- sincerely after 20 years. That's, that, that's major. Hey, ladies and gentlemen, this is your boy Nigel. Please remember to subscribe, like, comment, and share. And hit that notification bell. I mean, fellas, think about it. When is the last time, or when was the last time you could recall your woman saying, I'm sorry, rather than saying, I apologize, or how many times do I have to apologize? But what about, I'm sorry? What, what can I do to make this right? That sounds kind of foreign, doesn't it? Well, we're going to talk about it. Let's get it. Men's feelings run deep. Look at, look at self-deletion. How often do you hear women saying bye-bye over a relationship? Men do that. We don't, and I, would, I would almost say that men would, if they could go into their hard wiring, men would like to cut that part of us out. But if we did, the species would suffer. A lot of women today are operating counter to your nature. Vulnerability, being feminine, is what you're supposed to do. Yeah, that's right. Preach your own. Preach your own, bruh. Yeah. Now, back to what I was saying. You know, are women really emotionally in tune with a man, you know, as far as, like, him being respected or, you know, you're apologizing when you have done something wrong and literally saying, you know, I- I'm sorry. Like, our women nowadays, martyr women, are they emotionally detached? Do they know how to conflict with a man? And if, you know, how would that be as far as trying to build with a woman like that? Is that even possible? Have you ever had a woman apologize to you? (sighs) Honestly, my mother didn't apologize to me, man. She did or did not? She did not. Have Have you ever had a girlfriend or somebody you dating some woman you're dating apologized to you. No, yeah, yeah, that was my point. I'm sorry. That's what I'm saying. Like, it, it hasn't happened since my mother. Like, nobody, no woman has ever. I When I look for it. So your mother has never apologized and neither have women you dated. Correct. So gentlemen, understand something. There's a, ladies and gentlemen, understand there's a school of thought that says, show me how you were parented and I will show you how you love. Show me how you were Give it emotion, and I will show you how you do. Many men don't get validation, apologies. You can't even question mama. So many black men accept substandard treatment in relationships because your love map is warped. Y'all know, like you said, when you go to look for an apology, what happened? It's It's more like... You made me feel like this, so this is right. Right. The reason I hurt you is because something you did to me, further invalidating your feelings. And they have meant no to shut you down, huh? They, they they have no forgiveness themselves. So when you make a mistake, they want you to go ten times harder than what they go. Man, ain't that something? Now, fellas, how many times have you experienced this scenario right here? Whereas if your woman has done something and try to invalidate it based on how you made her feel. Like, how is that even fair? Like, what's wrong with the accountability here? Why can't it just accept whatever they've done or rather talk about the situation which made them feel some type of way? But see, that's the whole point. Are they able to communicate? Are, are modern women good communicators? Go ahead. Ladies, y'all thought I was making it up. This guy's 26. Yeah, man, it's it's making me rethink marriage. It's making me rethink everything, man. Um, here's what I here's what I, I here what here's what I would hope the takeaway is: is it marriage? Marriage is an institution. Mm-hmm. It's the caliber and character of women we choose. Correct. Hey, I want to enjoy it one time, ladies and gentlemen. See, this is the difference in how. A man will raise his son or how men talk to other men when they experience this whole negative um, mindset of of marriage or wanting to get married. We we don't teach men 
how you know single mothers are or how other women would tell other women you know forget a man this you don't need a man that you can do good all by yourself no we educate our men listen don't give up just choose wisely you know get yourself established build yourself up and then you get you know what you are you understand what i'm saying you will find the woman that's for you based on your terms it's nothing wrong with that you work hard for that let's get so, it. i mean i get i get it i just Correct. want you to think that's want you to expand to only start dealing with women who aren't going to who realize that the, part of her job is uh, doing more than taking care of your dick it's taking care of your emotions and many and of our I women worry honest. about taking care of your dick but they don't take care of your brain and your emotions i'll be honest i have a trouble with i have a woman who takes care of me in every facet that i love but she doesn't look where i want her to look She's one of those six attainables, you know, like they can get up, but she doesn't get up enough. Mm. So well, I have, I'm 20, I'm 26. And I'm like, I can. I well, at 26 time. years old, at 26 years old, I'm going to move on to somebody else. My personal being you're far too young to be worried about serious relationship. I don't think you should really start thinking about serious relationship until a, in 35. Okay. 30 is when you start. And if you know if it's around 30, and you're on your purpose, you've got your money stacked, you've been putting your 60 hours a week, working 60 hours a week minimum that you're getting paid for. But if you go back through everything I said in my video, things I would do if I was a young man today. And if around 30 or so, you realize you want legacy marriage children, then you should start at that point thinking about marriage. But there's no way in hell I get married before age 35. So you got another five, four or five years to get to the point to where you even should be considering this no but afterwards hold on but afterwards you should have see this is the whole importance of speaking facts and speaking in terms of reality speaking in terms of things that's probable because you won't be so to fair to expect yourself dealt with enough women. women to only deal with women who can take care of all of your emo take care of your emotional needs and things like that you can deal with the physical stuff uh, as well go ahead Hey, that about sums it up, ladies and gentlemen. Remember to subscribe and hit the notification bell. And thanks for watching. Have a blessed day.